Here are five websites that I guarantee will help you pass school. All right, this first website, I'm glad I had no clue about when I was in school because I would have gotten no work done. But if you are in a pinch and you need to pass your class, then maybe you can use it. It's called Lit Solutions. And what this website allows you to do is take one of your textbooks. I have this PDF of one right here. And maybe in another video, I'll teach you how to get these PDF textbooks for free, but not right now. So like I said, I have this PDF textbook. You can see it's this one right here. I'm just gonna go to a random page, 541, and we have some problems that we need answered. So let's get the answer for number 21 right here. All we have to do is go back to our Lit Solutions, search for our textbook. It's College Algebra, I can't spell. And it is this one right here. Then we can pick the chapter, it is 4.4, and the problem, 21. And hit Generate Solution Link. And then when it's done, just click on the link. And we have the step-by-step -step solution right here on your screen. You can even download it for later if you need to. All right, similar to the last website, let's say you have a math problem that you need solving, but this time it's not actually coming from your textbook. For instance, I have this worksheet pulled up right here. It's asking us for the integral of this problem. And the last time I did integrals was like 10 years ago. So what I'm gonna do is go to this website called Symbolab. And what we can do now is just copy the problem that we have, go back to Symbolab, enter it in right here and hit go. And now if we scroll down, it'll show the steps needed to get the solution to this. And at the very bottom, it'll actually give you the solution with a graph right here. So let's double check the solution. Remember this, if we go back, hit show solution, it looks like it's the exact one. So it performed it correctly. All right, we covered the math portion of our powerful websites, but now we need to take care of chemistry. And for that, you can go to this website, ptable.com. Let me just say, if I had this when I was in school, it would have been so much easier to do chemistry because I do not remember a thing. But what this website is, is basically a periodic table, but it has every detail you need to know about each element. So if I wanna know what, I don't even know what this one is, vanadium, I don't know what that is. We'll go with neon. You can click on neon, and it'll give you all the attributes for neon on this left-hand side right here. And if you go up top, you can also click on these electrons tab, the isotopes tab, and the compounds tab. And from here, you can drag stuff on there and create different compounds. Enjoy. All right, I know I said I wasn't gonna show you how to get free books in this video, but there's actually one website that I feel like you need to know about, and it's completely legal. So let's say for English class, we need to read The Adventures of Huckleberry Finn. What you can actually do instead of buying it for $12 is go to this website, gutenberg.org. Then we can paste it in the search bar and hit go. And you can see we have the book right here. All we have to do is click on it and hit read this book online. So you can either read it online or you can, you know, we have the entire book or you can go back and download it. Now, before you go and try to download all these free books, keep in mind this website is only for books that do not fall under the copyright protection anymore, which means they're usually over 95 years old, but it's still a cool way to get free books. All right, this last website is great if you have a test coming up and you're in a pinch and you just need some material that'll help you study or, you know, maybe just cheat on the test. What you can do is go to this website, cheatography.com, and you can type in the class that you are taking. Let's just do AP Physics. And what this website does is show you cheat sheets for the class that you are taking. So if we click on this first link right here, It'll give us an entire sheet full of physics formulas. And what you can do is just download it to PDF. And now you have a two page PDF of any formula you may need to pass your test. Enjoy. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please consider liking it and subscribing. We out.